I'm Matt Clark, and this is my bullseye challenge. Matt Clark, Superman, taking on the bullseye challenge. If you're wondering why he's Two. called Superman, well, his name is Clark, and he was raised in Kent. Two. Well, he's going about it in leisurely manner in the scoring stakes. 25s get you up the course, but it doesn't get you in the hole. Two. That could be a nice little guide to the hole. One. Well, he's had 7.25s, but he hasn't found a ball. This is his last turn, you feel. Two. Well, he's had 9.25s. He's been consistent on the green, but he couldn't find the red. And that is Matt Clark's attempt. Matt Clark scores nine. Uh, I'm Neil Duff. This is my Bulls A challenge. Here he is, the Duff man. And he's straight into the bullseye. He's found two of them. Four. Nearly kick-started in perfect style. He probably would have had to stop the count if he found all three. He loves the ball. Two. Oh, he's even had one deflected out. Well, I had... Well, the only MC available. Paul Starr in my ear ahead of this, and he said that he'd be good at this. Three. Well, he was right. Well, we are ready. Neil's ready, and it's most certainly been bullseye time. But no score. their balls have dried up. So that is that. Does that just count in time? Two. Yes, it does. No score. Neil Duff scores 11. My name is Colin McGarry. This is my bullseye challenge. Colin McGarry of Northern Ireland, the latest to take on the bullseye challenge. Star of the World Seniors Tour. Two. And to be in the World Seniors Tour, you've got to hit bullseye in years, as Ray Stubbs says. Been finding the bullseye up until that particular point. Four. But then, like London buses, two come along at once. The man for Northern Ireland is hoping to be the chief of this particular competition. It's Cam Cradtwe and Two. Leonard Gates that lead the field in terms of the scores in the Bullseye Challenge. As you can tell, I've really polished Cam's name. Two. I think Conor McGarry's the only guy with two R's I can actually say properly. Two. Oh, time is ticking down. The last three for McGarry. Two. Outside the bullseye it goes. It'll have one more Hail Mary attempt. Oh, Two. Oh, and it finds the bullseye. Colin McGarry scores 16. My name is Juan van Dijk, and this is my bullseye challenge. Is it going to be a case of wham, bram, thank you, ma'am, here at the bullseye challenge? Bram van Dijk looking to... Take it on. The second most famous Van Dyke in the world at the Three. moment behind Virgil Van Dyke. And the way he threw them three, it looked like it was a Virgil Van Dyke pit of central defending on the bullseye. No score. Four. Well, he managed to find a way in there. He couldn't use the first two darts as a bit of a marker. Refereed by Charlie Corsafine. Three. World-class referee. World-class eater of carbonara as well. Three. As he continues to pepper the red bit, Bram. Oh, that's another one. Two. That's his fourth. And that's time. Bram Van Dyke scores 17. Hi, I'm Simon Preston. This is my bullseye challenge. Game on.
Well, welcome everybody. This is Simon Preston. That's not the start that he wanted. Remember, it's two points for that, for the bullseye. Two. And it's one point for the 25. Not using that real pace in between. This is a speed game, Simon. Or is it quality over quantity? There's his first 25. One. So he's got one. Bullseye, 125. But I'd recommend, he's got a big smile on his face, that he needs to be just a little quicker in between. One's played Peter Wright on the Pro Tour. No score. Lost that game 6-5. Really looking forward to be playing on this stage later on today. But if you play like this, you could be struggling, Simon. Three. Much better. That was smack bang in the middle. Perfectly refereed there by Charlie Costavine. Having a little chat and a little smile between them. He's represented Lancashire in County Darts. No score. Once again, misses that centre part of the board. Suddenly he realised he has to sprint, but no difference. No score. Simon Preston scores six. My name's Andy Hamilton, and I'm here for the Bullseye Challenge. Well, no introductions required. One of the real legends of the game, and a big favourite of mine, Andy the Hammer Hamilton. Famously One. got to the final of the World Championships and the world number two. I've recently been doing a, a lot of work with him in Butlins and he was going to wear his red coat for this. After that first attempt, Andy, I think he should have. He's that centre ball and get it. That's his first one of the game. So a couple of 25s. Maybe just he needs to be a little bit faster in between. This is a speed game, Andy, but I'll let you tell him, not me. Playing Really good darts at the moment. Really fancies his chances. Three. But I don't think he'll be peppering the highest score in this challenge. That's for sure. A big lick of the fingers. Another three minutes to get set up. And we're ten seconds to go, Andy. No score. Glenn is saying nout. It's not hammer time. No score. Andy Hamilton scores seven. Hi, my name's Trina Gulliver, MBE, and I'm going to do the Bullseye Challenge. Game on. And welcome to Trina Gulliver, MBE. I could be the greatest player in ladies dart, a real Two. trailblazer, the ten times champion of the world, the six times world master. Very proud winner of the World Darts Trophy as well. When I think of Trina, I think of all the battles she had with Francis Honsalar with Anastasia de Bromislova, Dieter Hedman. I mean, the game's just modernised so much now with Fallon Cherok and Bo Greaves getting the headlines. But this is the greatest of them all. I was there when she what? won a tenth. She wasn't expected to win it that time. But an absolute, it's fantastic to see her at the Motor Super Series doing the bullseye challenge. Hit one bull so far and three of those 25s as well. One. Need just a little bit more. Very quick in between the throws. So he's doing everything correct. Just the accuracy. But 10 seconds to go. Come on, trainer. Give us the bullseye. Final dart. One. Trina Gulliver, MBE, scores seven. I'm John Worsley, and this is my bullseye challenge. No score. So, Worsley into the bullseye. Four. Two of them, in fact. Well, the one ball. One. He's running riot in this particular challenge right now. He's practiced starts. So there was a couple of Australia bees. One. Made practice a little bit perfect. He is not Two. missing that outer centre of all that he did until that point. Four. Uh, just squeezed in the bullseye there. And that's that.
John Worsley scores 12. Hello, this is Matthew Edgar, and this is my Bullseye Challenge. Game on. Well, this is Matthew Edgar, and my name is Glenn Durrant. If you've never met Matthew, he's the Daventry Xmas Handicap Mixed Players Quarter Finalist. This is his greatest Five. challenge. He also tells me he's won the... And now he's cheating. He has Five to scored. cheat to try to beat my score. That is absolutely disgusting. Throw the man out the building. Seven. Doesn't count. Ridiculous. Poor. Get him off. And now he's cheating. Absolute cheat and still Eight. can't beat my score last week. Nine. Grime time. That's what his nickname should be. The Daventry Dosser. That's what his new name should be. What an absolute sausage. Look at the state of this. Martin Adams is going to absolutely 11. tear him apart tonight. 13. Cheated. No, because you're rubbish. Get off. He tells me he's an algorithm, whatever that means in Twitter. How's he done that? He left that in earlier. What a cheater. Uh, this is disgusting. For the Super Series, sort this out. No score. Matthew Edgar scores 13. Hello, I'm Martin Adams, and this is my Bullseye Challenge. We have a runner. The Womble, John Worsley. Well, Martin Adams is so much of a legend that he even has a runner to get his Two. darts. We've already seen the cheating. There is Matthew Edgar in this one, and poor Womble, John Worsley, is going to be absolutely shattered after this. It's health and safety watching it. Watch he doesn't trip. One. Martin Adams, I tell you what, I didn't get this treatment last week, that's for sure. Remember, it's one point for the 25. Two. Joking aside, the pentathlon, one of the toughest things to win. Martin Adams has won it more than absolutely anybody. But normally, he's so, so good in that bullseye. Honestly. One. God, look at you. <laughs> look at John Worsley go. He started off at 16 stone. He's going to end up about 11 stone five out of this. One. I'm just taking his time there. Not very happy with this. Tell you what, he's quick in between, though. Legend that is. One. Martin Adams. Martin Adams, assisted by John Worsley, scores eight. Hi, I'm Gary Stone. This is my bullseye challenge. Well, this is Gary Stone, as you've just heard there. If you couldn't understand it, subtitles are available. But you're inside Gary Stone, an incredible dart player. He could do some real damage here. Very, very quick in between the hockey. Commentator's curse once again. Sorry, Gary. One. Does is at it again. Yet to hit the bullseye yet. As you can see, a big Celtic supporter. Oops, uh, Rangers supporter. Please edit that out before Gary Stone sees it. Four. There he is. He's finally in the bullseye. Hoping to win the WDF World Championships this year. I think he fancies his chances next year. Mark my Two. words. 825 is in a bullseye. If he can find a couple of bulls here, he's got a chance, you know. Very, very quick in between. What are your battle dart there? Needs more haggis, I think. He's beginning to find it now. Lots and lots of 25s. Three. This is a great effort. 16 points. Super One. darts. Gary Stone scores 17. Hello, I'm Michel van der Hoss, and this is my bull challenge. Yep. One. Michel van der Horst, the latest to take on the Bullseye Challenge. This is what happens when you've got darts at nine Two. and then a meeting on Zoom at one. I miss Zoom meetings. The opportunity just to lay Three. in your bed in your underpants. You can turn the camera off and pretend that you're in the room. I'll tell you what, Michel van der Horst is very much in the room and he's very much in the red bit. And scored thus far. Two. 
And he's continuing to pepper the green bit. One more throw to go. He's not deterred by the pace of the challenge. He'll go at his own speed. What? when you're consistent, that doesn't matter. Michel van der Horst scores 13.